We are all excited that Jake Fromm is starting this Saturday night in South Bend, Indiana, as Georgia is playing Notre Dame right here on 41 NBC. And a kid from Middle Georgia, from Warner Robins, is going to be the starting quarterback for UGA. If you've seen him play, even if you've seen Fromm's highlights on the end zone the last few years, you probably know he's pretty good. Then you hear what people around him say about him, how he's a leader, how he has the intangibles that you want in a winning quarterback, how he's the guy you want to lead your team, and you understand why many hoped he'd unseat Jacob Eason and be Georgia's quarterback this season. Of course, this isn't exactly the way most believed it would happen, as Eason is now hurt and out for a while. But with all the high expectations, the belief that many have in Fromm, he now must walk on a legendary football field at Notre Dame and get his first college start. Now, I'm not discounting anything that Fromm could do on Saturday, but we must be realistic. We can't expect this kid to wave a magic wand and have a perfect game. He's a freshman, so we must expect mistakes. The danger in this game is if Fromm does well and leads Georgia to a win, no one is ever going to want to see Easton again. Let's hold off on giving Fromm the Heisman Trophy or anything about anointing him as the savior of the Georgia program. As Kirby Smart said on Tuesday, this game is not about Jake Fromm. We're excited for him because he's a hometown kid, but Georgia will need a whole lot more than Fromm to win on Saturday. Sure, if he does well, they'll have a great chance of winning, but the key for Fromm to play well is the Georgia offensive line. It's still a work in progress, and at some point they must find stability. If they protect Fromm and open holes for the great running backs, Fromm will likely be okay. And what about Georgia's defense? They were great last week against Appalachian State, but Notre Dame is a lot better offensively than App State. They have a quarterback, Brandon Wimbish, who is a dual threat. Plus, running back Josh Adams is very good. The Georgia defense will get its first real test, and we need to see the defense leave up to the expectations. Forget about what Jake does. If the Georgia defense plays well, the Bulldogs will win. Georgia should score some points as the Notre Dame defense has some issues. We're going to need to see Jake find a receiver to be his go-to guy, whether it's one of his tight ends or someone like Terry Godwin, who was MIA last weekend. And those big hogs on that offensive line must open the holes for Nick Chubb, Sonny Michelle, and DeAndre Swift. So let's be thrilled that a hometown boy is starting at quarterback for Georgia against Notre Dame, but let's not put all the pressure on Jake Fromm. Let's remember, he's a freshman, and freshmen make mistakes, even special freshmen. That's what Jake is, and hopefully he can be one of many who help Georgia win on Saturday night.